If you follow me on Twitter, then you've been warned that this might happen one day. Welcome to my grotesque parody of a whole video. Okay, so once a week, I like to go out and have a wander around charity shops, thrift shops, uh, places like deals, and just look for cheap crap. Stuff that I can make props out of for, well, mostly for this channel. Um, stuff that I can make costumey things out of. Anything that might be a little bit useful. Usually I don't buy anything at all. It's, it's, usually there's just, maybe the stuff isn't cheap enough, maybe it's not crappy enough, uh, maybe it's just not quite right for what I'm working on. Today, today was a good day. I'm gonna go into the the deals stuff first because the thing I got in Goethe is very special. The deal stuff is kind of average. I got a good haul in deals though because it's September now and they've started stocking Halloween supplies. I fucking love Halloween. Halloween is the best season there is. Anyway, let's get started first thing I found was this little guy. I um, was a little disappointed when I got it home. I was expecting the jaw to do stuff. Only does that. The eyes don't even boggle around. But I still have uses for it. I have plans. Don't worry, I have plans for this thing. Even if it isn't that great. Next thing. Sack of eyeballs always need a sack of eyeballs. These are probably just going to be useful for like actually putting eyes in like busts and sculptures and masks and things. Um, I don't know, maybe I'll actually need bouncing eyes at some point. Actually, uh, there's a good chance I'm going to need bouncing eyes at some point. Alright. These two, the spooky projector torches. Honestly, I just got these because each one has a single LED and a battery pack. And those are two elements missing from the, uh, well, for the lightsaber speed build I'm planning on doing. I'm gonna be building a, uh, the handle of a lightsaber, just as a prop. It's kind of a prop maker's rite of passage. And I need a single LED and a battery pack. So that's what these are for. Now this little guy is fun. What I want to do with this is uh, a couple of months ago I got a shitty little drone from Little, cost me nothing, and uh, I want to mount this on top of it and have it just zooming around on my shitty drone and I think that'll be a lot of fun. I'll probably get rid of the scythe though, because the scythe looks a little too shitty. But oh well. And finally, the best thing, the very best thing, like, the very best, like no one ever was. I got this in Goethe. The batteries run out, unfortunately. I was messing around with it earlier, but it dances. And what I'm planning on doing with this is I'm, is I'm going to skin it. And I'm going to make it a new skin that won't have any eyes or a nose or it'll have a mouth, maybe teeth. And I'm gonna put new batteries in it and just see how horrible that looks moving around when I bought this. Anyway, so I actually saw this in the window with Goethe sometime last week and I knew immediately that I wanted it, and I knew immediately what I was gonna do with it. And, but I didn't have any cash on me, so I decided, you know, I'll wait till next week. And I went in today, and it wasn't in the window, and I was so sad. I looked around and I couldn't find it anywhere, and I was just about to leave, and I thought, you know, there's a basket of stuffed animals right there, I'll check, just to make sure. And there he was. 
And when I brought him up to the counter, the girl behind the counter, she, oh, poor, poor girl, poor girl. She was like, oh, that's great, Elmo found a home. And I'm just, inside, I'm just, oh no. You don't know what my plans are for this. You shouldn't feel so happy for him. So that poor, poor naive girl. But, while I am going to skin this and I do have a use for Elmo's body, I'm not totally sure what to do with the skin yet. And that's where I might need your help. I have two options that I'm considering. One is to use the skin to make an Elmo skin hat for myself that I'll probably wear at conventions, because why the fuck not? The other option is to stuff and mount Elmo's head like a hunting trophy. Tell me which one you think I should do by posting in the comments. If you have an idea of your own, post that as well, but also say which of those two options you prefer, just in case, you know. But yes, I think I had a good haul today. Elmo, you have no voice, yet you must scream. Decide his fate. Decide his fate. Well, that certainly was a video, wasn't it? I'm sure you had a response to that, whether it was positive, negative, or neutral. Whatever your response was, you're going to like this video, you're going to share it, and you're going to leave a positive comment down below, or else.